approach that guy. I think my nade hit him directly and he gave me a kill. Oh my god, did you much, Jane? Is it seventh, maybe? No, it was like... What's up guys welcome back to another video it has been a while i have had so much stuff going on irl but we are back this is the return hopefully i can get some content going out regularly for you guys and without further ado this is a special one because i am on omelet's account you're about to see why we're going to start on hunter i'll try and play all three classes and when we play warlock we will not use ophidians just so the handling is fair but we're going to be checking out the found verdict time lost version uh as with all the time lost weapons you have to do the Vault of Glass challenges to get this. However, the fan verdict is a bit different. You actually get it from the Triumph for completing all the other ones. So you've got to do the challenge on every single encounter and then you claim the Triumph and you get one. But unlike, say, doing the Time Loss Fate Bringer where you can do your three kills the Templar challenge every time it's the challenge and get three drops, you cannot do this with the fan verdict. You get one roll and that is it in terms of drops. And then if you want another one past that, you have to do Atheon on Master, turn in spoils and get one. So I've been grinding on my own account. I'm about 600 spoils in and I cannot get anything. However, Omelette to the rescue, so shout out to the boy Omelette. We have got full choke, accurized, surplus, opening shot, assault mag if we want it, and a range masterwork. The nice thing about Fan Verdict is that it can use adept handling, uh, because it is, you know, an adept shotgun. So, uh, yeah, I think this is the best shotgun in the game. I've heard amazing things about it. All the scrims and tournament players all swear by this. This is the only shotgun they use. Without further ado, let's get into it. Okay, we got Twilight Yeah. I'm using this eyes liner just because I personally don't like rangefinder, so we're going to be using a rapid hit moving target roll. If you're curious why I don't like rangefinder, because I know people will probably ask in the comment section, it's because it actually increases, well, decreases your field of view. It increases the zoom, which I really don't like. It throws my muscle memory off, especially when I'm playing like aggressively and taking closer range fights. So for me, it is a no go. And we got one, had a pre nade, so he was always going to die. I also haven't played in like two weeks, so I might. You know, I might I might take take a couple minutes to get back. I'm also capping a flag, so YouTube comments, please tell me you're proud. I get a side angle here. This Iceland is not gonna have too much range, is the only issue. He's dead, right? I don't know I don't know what he survived on, but he survived on something. I, I might push because we're low. Looks like he is, so we can what the hell? I didn't press jump. I don't have shotgun ammo. I do now. Oh wait, you got behind me? How the fuck did that happen? I, I am so unaware right now. Oh wait, that one shot him hip fire? No wonder I've been losing all my shotgun fights. People have been using this thing against me. Oh, that's the scout rifle guy. We know that. Gotta keep paying attention to what loadouts the enemies have. Nice three tap there. Okay, okay, this is feeling good. Ah, that was awkward. I was missing a lot of shots. We got on a 10 streak there. Definitely a good start. The shotgun feels amazing. It handles really, really well with surplus and adept handling and quick charge. So that is already super encouraging. I also feel like this gun looks really cool. I don't know why. I think it looks better than Bow Winters without the ornament. Oh my god, I survived his shotgun? How? I know it's early to be saying this because I'm in the first game of recording, but I just, I don't feel like I'm as good of a player as I was before I took a break. Like, I feel like I need to get the rust off, so I kind of want to make a follow-up video to this in a couple weeks. Maybe once I get one on my own account, we make a follow-up video because I'm going to be farming this thing. Oh, he's so low. Let's go. We got that. We do have them double capped still. Oh wait, my team's going off. This could be it. We could have this. And this thing feels good. No, my knight didn't tag him. Damn. No. Dude, they're all so low. What the fuck just happened? And my team got the cleanup. 149 to 149. I'm out of it. Let's go. 
Well, hope it's like I'm warming up still for today. I'm still gonna be shaking the rust off, but that was the warm up game. We dropped a 40 bomb. Definitely not a bad first game, but holy shit. This guy with the Antius had my number as well, bro. I could not win a shardy fight. The shotgun feels really good. I'm just not using it well enough yet. Let's go. We got dead cliffs. Bro, I thought I loaded up trials for a second because I saw the map. Muscle memory. All right, let's get it. Let's get a good game. Fire map. Ah, uh, she might use thorn. Yeah, use, yeah, let's use thorn. That'd be fun. Oh, D1 combo, a Thorn, and a Found Verdict. That's a good nade. I have another one low in there that I have the shotgun. Damn, he got the shield out at the perfect time. I really want to, like, play more aggro, but I don't have shotgun ammo. Let's go see if we can kill a different guy off spawn with a primary. Got one. Two tap one, the other guy should be low as well. Both dead. Get my health back and then I'm going to slide this. Two taps. Oh, my perk. Oh, I, was, I didn't know if my perk was going to run out or not. But he got a melee off. That was smart from him. Really good start to the game though. Thorn feels amazing. This is already feeling a lot better than that Eyes Luna was for me. I do also think I am a bit more warmed up now. As much as I am still washed because I haven't played in two weeks. Definitely ain't going to go as bad. Oh my god, that guy got shit on. Got that bottom tree damage resist. It. Go back for this guy on B. Don't have shotgun reloaded. Now we do. Nice. Okay. Reload everything. Oh, he's jumping above the door. I see him. Unfortunately, I can't do too much about him. One with a shotgun, dude. Those swaps do feel really fast. Could be more spawning back here. I know dead cliff spawns. They are gonna be here for a while. No, dude. If I had primary ammo, I could have killed that guy. Damn it. Got one close. Let's get a reload off and fight this guy. Uh, unfortunately, it looks like we're gonna win this game really quick, so I'm not gonna get to use it that much. But this thing's already feeling nice. It's a good nade. Easy tag. Oh, we kept them low, so we can go with the shotgun. I want to walk up on this guy, but I'm a bit scared. We got a headshot on him. I also want to try and get an arc to go in here, but I'm a bit scared. Okay, let's go. That guy was lasering me. That guy almost killed me as well, bro. I've been so low all game. And see what hit him. All right. What the hell? We got the Mercy. It was a good game. Uh, a good game. Cannot complain. The Thorn was feeling good as well. Obviously, it's a shotgun-focused video, but the Thorn was feeling nice. We dropped 24 with three deaths. One of them was because we jumped in with a linear fusion at the end of the game. But yeah, really, really good game. The shotgun was feeling nice there. All right. We got Dead Cliffs. Uh, I just played Dead Cliffs on Hunter. So normally, I would back out here. But because I like the map, and the last game was a Mercy anyway, I'm just going to play it out. We're playing Bottom Tree Striker, by the way, if you were curious, on the Titan build. Bottom Tree Striker, Catapult, Lightning Nades, and I think that's everything. And the Big Shield, of course. My nade not do more? Oh, okay. <laughs> Spoke too soon. Alright, we'll take the three-piece. There's a guy here. Holy shit, Titan Melee is insane. Shield, because they have two angles on me. Behind this, he's 1 HP. Nice. Take that, we take that. Bunch of shots, because we got Thorn put. Oh, bunch of shots that I miss! Maybe that. Oh, no, he blocked it. That sucks. I'm sure I got a kill, and I literally did like two damage to that guy. I think my nade hit him directly, and it gave me a kill. My god, they do much, Jane. This is it seventh, maybe? No, we, fl we split the spawn. I think that was, that was six. Damn it, bro. I'm just aping. I missed. Oh, wait, no, I didn't. I think I hit him like a tiny bit, so my shotgun could get the cleanup. I was going to go behind us. So we could push this guy. Oh, he went through my shield. 
soon as I saw random hit markers after I hadn't shot, I was like, wait, <laughs> wait a minute. Oh, I two tapped that guy. Oh, wait, I had Thorn Perk. This one could be a seven. No, it's split, bro. I want to gun that guy because I knew if I went in super, I wouldn't have got the kill fast enough. Damn, we went on two really good sprees that game when we got him in the Dead Cliff spawn trap. I like how they, they put this map in the Destiny content vault to fix the spawns, and the spawns just didn't change. No one ever noticed that. That was like the reason Dead Cliffs got removed from Quick Play. Yeah, a really good first game on Titan. Titan in sixes is feeling good. I'm going to have to uh, get another game because we played Dead Cliffs twice and it was a mercy. 30 defeats in a pretty short game with a 7.5 efficiency. Let's get into another one. Okay, Altar of Flame. It's a bit more like it. Bro, you probably aren't going to see them in the gameplay. I got Bannerfall like four times and Dead Cliffs twice. Those are the only games I got to play. I don't mind Altar of Flame. Plus, I really want variety, so I'm with it. Out of that nade, a little two-piece there. Nice shot. But I'm trying to go, I'm trying to go shotgun some stuff. That could be a really nice nade. Oh, I only hit him for 60 with it. Bro, I, I, I wish I could do more, but... Alright, so I'm going. My teammate just left the game right there. I went to help him and he just... Uh, Enkuch out. <laughs> you saw the enemy got confused as well, because after he killed me, he just stood still for a minute. Oh my god, he has a symmetry perk. I got two tapped. I hear him with a symmetry out on the right. I just had him shoot over here. Yeah. Uh, this guy's going kind of crazy. So, symmetry video coming soon? I've, I don't think I've ever used that thing. I honestly don't even know how that gun works. I know you change the firing mode and then do big damage, and that's what that guy keeps doing to me, but... I'm gonna be honest, when I was in the open right there, I tried to hunt a dodge. We take those, we take those. Made that because they jump up. Shield this side. A little bit of cover. Okay, never mind. It's terrible shield, but we're alive. They have four bullets here. I want to go for a... Nah, whatever. Just going to back up and reload. Yeah, behind this guy. The shotgun feels amazing, man. I feel like I've just been getting distracted. By the fact that this is a natural shotgun video. I've been distracted by just me trying to not be bad at the game anymore. Because I haven't played in so long. But Back to the shotgun. This thing does feel insanely consistent. I'm vibing with it. And we actually are making this comeback. Why can't I not shoot? Oh my god. I'm going baby on baby. Hey. Oh shit, I made a mistake. Fuck. Get out of here. I'm busy. Oh, he came out. He threw. One more here. What? I missed that shotgun, bro. I thought he was dead. I turned away. I had a free kill. That's my bad. I think we can get this comeback. I just need to not throw. The Lorenz guy to my right is going to make things difficult. Take this free kill and hide again. Look for a shotgun fight, hopefully. No, that guy's won. Oh, now I'm in a really bad spot. I got sorted. Can I spawn up and get back in time to get some kills? Please, teammates, stay alive. Oh my god, wait. Wait, pause champ. The dream is not dead. Holy shit, we won that again. Bro, two... I've, I've recorded like five games. We've had two insane clutches. 149s to 150s. Holy shit. Let's go. And we got 43. I definitely died a lot. I was just flying in, doing some dumb stuff there. But some decent sprees. Definitely a cool comeback. Okay. 
So for the Warlock game, I said I wanted to do it without Ophidian, so we got like a fair feeling of the handling. So I threw the Constines on, just because I didn't really know what else to use. I didn't want to change his normal build. So I, Ophidian's was an easy swap to Constines. And because we're using Constines, I wanted to use Hawkmoon on because I watch Sir D all the time. I always see him with Constines and Hawkmoon, so yeah, that's the boy Sir D. Go for a shotgun fight here, and mine, he's quite far away. No. Get me out. Oh my god, I'm alive. Wait. Hold up. Oh, you gave me an overshield? That's actually big. Kill this guy. I got you, my boy. Wait, wait this overshield lasts for so long. If, if the Titan runs the fragment of increased overshield duration, does that mean everyone that gets the overshield gets increased duration or it ju just works for him? I'm actually curious about that. If anyone knows in the comments, please let me know. Because that seemed like a really long overshield. Got health back from that. And just dash through the dash through that. Made that in case. I do want to check if I have fastball. I think I'm safe to do it. I don't think they're gonna push yet. I do have it. I don't know why my nades feel so slow. That's low. Didn't slide there, that was weird. I think we might be on for a we ran here, or we're on like 13 or some shit. I'm gonna reload. Made this. Oh, I didn't want a mantle. That almost screwed me over. I'm dead hit. I jinxed it, man. Why'd I say anything? I love using Hawkmoon as well. I've been using it a lot more recently, even in like trials and stuff. I'm pushing this, screw it. Take that three piece. I, the only thing I think maybe I'd prefer is to not have surplus and just have... I don't know, I think this is the guard roll on paper, especially because Ophidians exist, but I really like slide shot on my shotguns. What I was going to say is maybe have a barrel that gives you more handling, so like barrel shroud, and then you could use slide shot maybe. You don't need alternative role I could think of. I still think this is objectively better when it comes to killing people, which is obviously quite important. But from what I understand, Full Choke's going to be getting a nerf here next season, so well, it could completely switch up what the role is. Obviously, I know there's only two right now, but we might find some people. Yeah, we are going to find more. That's worth. Oh man, I ran out. Just was about to kill him. Nice shot on his part though. Holy shit, that's a lot of people. Crouch here. That guy's going for all the super snipes. I respect it. Why run when you could just headshot it? Oh no, I'm sorry. I wish I could be of more assistance, but uh, I suck. It's so weird playing like this aggro, like not even going for like primary shots in a situation like that. Because I keep like playing normally and then I realize I'm doing a shotgun review, so I'm just trying to ape stuff. This all at once, I think. Dude, Icarus dash is so good. Like, being able to commit to that and just dash out because I hadn't fallen yet. Damn, this game went down to the time limit. We have time to get one more kill, maybe. Oh, we got a collateral with a shotgun there. GG. We got to play two games on the other classes because we had mercies. And then we played just the one game on Warlock, but I feel like it went really well. Ended up dropping 49 with a 5.44. Obviously, we took the Ophidians off, so it would be a more fair comparison. And I feel like I also did kind of get carried away with the Hawk Moon, just because as soon as I get some Paracausal stack charges, all I want to do is Hawk Moon. Okay, guys, thanks so much for watching today's video. I do hope you enjoyed. Shout out to Armlet, first of all, for letting me use his account. Uh, he is a friend of mine. I do trials carries with him all the time when I'm streaming. Check his Twitch out, twitch.tv slash iArmlet. He's a really, really good dude. Really, really good player. Far better player than myself. Uh, and, you know, he, he deserves a lot from content creation. The dude's got a lot of potential. 
and uh it'd been a lot if you guys would show them some love so the link will be in the description and it'll you know i'll show the twitch channel on stream now check him out when you see him live and there's quite a good chance they'll be playing with me when you see him live because we stream together a lot the fan verdict is insane doing this is kind of maybe mad because i wish i had one on my own account and i do not so i guess i'm gonna go back to the templar and farm spoils for the 20th time and hope i can get one this thing's insane like i said full choke change is coming maybe it will make it worth it to put barrel shroud on and then you can just run barrel shroud adept handling maybe even a handling masterwork and then you'd run uh slide shot here so the role i'd be talking about after full choke is nerfed would be barrel shroud accurize rounds slide shot opening shot handling masterwork adept handling I think that'd be really good. But for now, this is the best in the game. Uh, Assault Mag and Accurized, having the option between the two is super nice because this one, I feel like, is personal preference. I personally prefer Accurized because I feel like with an aggressive frame shotgun, I should only be shooting once. I either shoot them once, swap to my primary, or shoot them once in melee. So I don't personally go for Assault Mag, but I know a lot of players love using Assault Mag. So uh, I, it, this thing's crazy. It's it's a 7 out of 5 right now. You have, you have a 5 out of 5, and then you have the option here. Or a 6 out of 5, I can't count. Thank you guys so much for watching today's video. Again, I do apologize for the lack of uploads recently. I've had a bunch of stuff going on in my personal life. Uh, it's been hectic. It's been a rough period for me. But with this video, hopefully this you know marks the return of the uploads being consistent again. If you enjoyed, please be sure to like and subscribe. We're almost at 70,000 subs. I appreciate you guys. Catch you on the next one. Peace.